What's up, Diglets? So, here with the Pokemon Sun and Moon hype, I stopped by GameStop and I finally picked up a copy of Sun and Moon pre released, well, midnight release. And we're going to do a quick playthrough. I apologize, I don't really have the quality up right now because my 3DS capture device is not working. So we're gonna have to use my phone and rig this 3DS to make it work. All right, so like I said, sun and moon copies. Got the Alolan starters. And GameStop hooked me up with this cool poster at the midnight release. It's got action shot on the back, Alolan map on the front, kind of like what they did for a uh, Omega Ruby Alpha Sapphire, and I'm going to play Moon for this stream, so there are reasons behind it. One of them is because Drampa is, I heard, a Moon exclusive, and he is Bay for me. And second of all, Moon has reverse timing, so midnight is actually 12 in the afternoon, so for night recording people like me that want to record during daytime of the game, we will have daytime footage. All right, so honestly, I'm not too disappointed with the quality of this, even though it's a phone camera. We are going to start Pokemon Moon. Let's do this. I'm super hyped for this. I don't know if you guys knew this, but I'm a huge Pokemon fan. Even though you probably should know this, because I am a Diglett. Oh, man. Let's play this in Japanese. Just kidding. Let's not do that. English mode. Begin game. Ooh, you have a message from Lola Region's own Professor Kakui. I like the music. Good evening, fine time. Ugh. So the day has finally come that you're moving to Alola. Alola is a region made up of several islands. That could be the reason the region is chock full of nothing but rare Pokemon. Yeah. There's no shortage of cool Pokemon out here in Alola either. Such mysterious creatures. We got a rock rough right now. You find them all over in grass and caves, in the sky and sea. Here in Alola, we love our Pokemon, and we depend on them heaps, too. Some of us even battle with them, if we call ourselves Pokemon trainers. Yeah, that's what I do with them. Rockruff, can you wait until I'm done talking to play? Okay. Alright, so I gotta ask you some questions about yourself. Oh, the classic. We're gonna get the boy or girl. He doesn't know if I'm a boy or a girl. Which photo should I use for your trainer passport? Hopefully not one that I take with my face. Um, let's see. I'll probably go... Hmm... Uh, I don't know. I'll probably go with this one. Let's do that. Yep, alright. Spell my name out for you. I'll do... Diego. Yes, I do go by Diego. 10-4, good buddy. Oh, he's a trucker, okay. Ooh, it's a name that hits you like a thunderbolt out of the sky. Can't wait to see you in person. Alright, ending the transmission here. Oh! And I was secretly just FaceTiming and I gotta get some boxes. Dang, that looks cool. Got somebody running. Oh, this is the professor's assistant. Okay. She was in the Sun and Moon trailers. She's bringing some urgent business here. Oh, that's the uh, the gas pog. Oh, are they gonna steal that from her? Oh, she's running.
Dang, this is quite the action sequence for the beginning of the game. Oh, snap. Got cornered. What's going on? Oh no, what's going on here? I think that was Cosmog in the bag. Oh my. I am so hyped right now. I am sorry if it's not showing, but I am tired. It has been quite a while. Three months later. Oh, got a nice little shot. I think this might be my house in the game. Yeah, it looks like it. I don't know how many of you guys played the Sun and Moon demo, but it was pretty fun. Good stuff. I'm going to be transferring that uh, Ash Greninja in the next thing. All right. Ah, could anything be more soothing? The first evening spent under a Lola's calm moon. I feel like I could stay out here all night. That's enough of that. Time to unpack all these boxes. I don't really know why you'd unpack at night. Anyway, go get Diego for me. Yep, Meowth is coming. Oh, he's looking for me looks an awful lot like your room from X and Y. Oh, well, not really. Got a little more space. Oh, I don't think that's a sound I'd like to be woken up by. Alright, can I get up? I am pressing buttons. Nothing is happening. Oh, I had to press the D-pad. There we go. What do you want? Alright, let's see. Let's see. I'm kind of just looking around, just... Oh, there's a box. It's a box full of my belongings. Let's run downstairs. Oh, nice place you got going here. I do like it a lot. Now it'd be full of energy by now. Alright, I am not, but we're gonna get this until I get my starter. You come to meet some Alolan Pokemon? Of course I am. That's right, I wanna hurry up and meet some too. Living in the Alola region now, beautiful islands everyone wants to visit. I'm sure Pokemon living in this place like this must be friendly. Doorbell. Kakui, let's go let him in. Oh, he let himself in. It's a little rude. Hey there. Name's Kukui. Good to meet you, cousin. Tired after a long trip all the way out here to Lola. Feeling any jet lag? Yes, definitely. It's nighttime. Oh, I came from Kanto. Okay, cool. Good Gen 1 throwback. It's still nighttime out here. Yes, we just arrived yesterday. Hey there, I'm let myself in. Call me Kikuyu. Yeah. Welcome to Alola. Battle on the Indigo Gym Leaders back in Kanto all those years ago, you know. Wow. Okay. Been in love with Alola and Pokemon ever since, so I finally decided to come here myself. I'm supposed to be visiting there to research Kanto moves and all. Knew a thing or two about battling, but those Kanto Gym Leaders proved me wrong. Hey now, let's get a move on to the next town over. Time for you to meet the island Kahuna and get yourself a Pokemon. A Pokemon? What? Yes. Alright. Kahuna lives in Iki Town is always happy to give 
Any kid who wants to an adventure for the first Pokemon. Yep, okay. I'm not gonna take them on yet. They're unbeatable for folks like me and you. I don't think so. We'll see about that. They simply give my boy a Pokemon? Yes, that's the question everyone has been asking since Gen 1. Hurry up and get ready. Bags and hat are still in the boxes in your room. And I think I left a copy of your adventure rules. Let's go get a quote-unquote style and hat. That'll match his. This is the box I was looking at, and they didn't let me. Let's put that hat on. Oh, oh, got them styling shoes. Shoes, backpack, hat man. Looking fresh. Getting ready to go. Let's do this. I really like what they did with the character sprites. They're really nice. Have a good time out there. Oh, she's very nice, cleaning my whole room by the time I come back with my new Pokemon. Which I am leaving a secret until I actually pick it. And he complimented my styling hat, which means a lot. Yep, alright, cool, let's do this. I am excited. here. Oh, there he is. Okay, cool. That didn't take very long. Welcome to paradise. After all, you can go anywhere as long as you got Pokemon helping you out here. Alright, let's do this. First we're off to Iki Town. Talk to this dude. Yeah, holding the B button makes you run. Gen 3? Secrets? I don't know. Gen 3 I thought was the first game you ran in. Pressing a button will let you trade Pokemon. Yes. Indeed. Let's go over here. Oh, is he? Yep. Uh, that. Can I talk to him again? Yes, I am. It is much more graphically pleasing than I remember the other regions to be. Gotta recommend another move to me. Oh yeah, so this professor's move, in case you guys didn't know, or his specialty is Pokemon moves. Uh, I don't know which moves you want to use. Yeah, come find me this Pokemon, and then I'll battle you. Yeah, so he's a Pokemon move specialist, actually. Is he going to show me how to catch Pokemon, like every person does in the beginning of every game? Dive into tall grass, try to catch some wild Pokemon to add to your team. Yes, the basics. Oh. Then they go in battle. Dang straight. You got Young Goose over here. Memorizing those names already. I don't know what that is, Alolan Meowth? Looks like it. Let's have a battle sometime. I will battle as soon as I get my Rowlet. Alright, so. Oh, that's actually a lot better, I think. Cool. Yeah, that's actually a lot better. Alright, we're here. times where people come to worship the Pokemon that watches over Melee Melee Island. Tapu Koko. Oh, dude, I'm hyped for him. I want to catch him so bad. Question mark? What's going on here? We're supposed to meet everyone here, right? Maybe they're all back in Mahalo. Okay, Mahalo Trail. That's where ruins of our guardian deity Tapu Koko are. Yeah. Do me a solid and find the island Kahuna. We're around here to make sure we don't miss each other. You can't miss him. He looks just like a kahuna. Thank you. That's extremely helpful. I know exactly what I'm looking for now. Let's do this. I think I vaguely remember what he looks like. I got a notification. Oh. A 
apparently we want to go up the ruins. What's up here? Is there... No, it's just an empty stage for battling. Should I talk to some people? Let's see if this guy knows. Leave out of the tall grass. Yep. What about this guy? On sunny days like this, it's nighttime. It's not sunny days like this. Must be off helping any trainer. Yeah, okay, I, we gotta find him. Alright, so I'm guessing he's this way. Just wanted to talk to the characters, see if they had anything interesting to say, or give me. Up here. Oh, this is part of the trail that we took in the demo. We can't come out. We'll get in trouble if anyone sees you. Go this way. I keep forgetting you can't use the D-pad at all. You have to use the uh, control stick. All right. Cosmog. He looks really adorable, and I really want that Pokemon. He was exciting. Oh. Oh. Oh, oh, you see, you let him out of the bag, he gets attacked by Spiro. This is what happens. Yep, see, there's your problem. Oh my god, do I have to go save him? Like, what do I do? She's gonna be like, help me! Save him, take a Pokemon and, and save him. She's like, stop him! Uh... What's wrong? Who are you? Uh, I guess I'll be like, I know what's wrong, so I'll ask her who she is. Never mind me. You have to help it, please. Save Nebby! Do it! Oh. P ew, ew. Alright, well, I can't save it from Spiro because. Okay, her legs might give out. But I don't have a Pokemon to battle that Spiro. I'm just gonna shoo them away. Oh, okay. Okay. I guess I'm not supposed to run. Nope, it doesn't matter. Oh, okay. He is getting attacked maliciously by Spiro. I'll hold him. Get attacked by Spiro myself. Man, these Spiros are pricks. Oh, okay. Well, that's how you die. All right, game over. That's how the game ends. Oh, Tapu Koko's gonna save our ass. What? What? He's like Superman, only cooler. Cause he has electricity. Dang. He's like, oh. Oh snap. Island Guardian, man. That's an Island Guardian for you. That's what they do. You. Thank goodness! You tried using your power again, didn't you? Oh, Nabby. And, you know, the last time you used it. I won't see you like that again. No, I shouldn't say that. I'm sorry, Nabby. You didn't try to save me that time. And I couldn't help you in return. Pew! What? What is that? Pew pew! A sparkling stone. It feels almost warm somehow. Like my heart, please forgive me. I'm so grateful for you to help us out in this dangerous spot. Can you answer my question? Who are you? I think this stone must belong to you. That's not the answer. You are avoiding the question, young lady. I obtained a sparkling stone, though, and that's really what matters at the end of the day, because it's sparkly. Please don't tell anyone about this, about seeing Nebby. It's a secret, okay? Come on, into the bag, Nebby. Pew! Um, where did might get attacked again by some wall of the Pokemon or something? Do you think you can see us back to town? Yeah, I, I could. I mean, that's a thing I could do.
Looks like you missed the kahuna. Yeah, you found my assistant. Yep, it's his assistant. Just in case, this is my assistant. You can call me Lily. Move to Lola. Take good care of him. You're also one of the professor's acquaintances. It's nice to meet you. The kahuna is back. Okay, cool. He's back. That's very convenient. Our guardian's chosen one is back. Let's try this Pokemon using all of Alola. Have I missed something? I thought we were meeting here. I am the Kahuna of this island, after all. Wherever there's a problem on the island, it's my duty to resolve it. Okay. What were you saying before? Some reason I thought I saw Tapu Koko flying about. Yeah, he definitely was. Maybe he was being attacked. I got it out. The bridge collapsed. Yep, and then he swooped in and saved us. That's something you don't hear every day. Nope, it is not. Mm, rather fickle creature. Guardian was moved to save you. I think we have cause to celebrate. It seems we can entrust this brave and kind young boy with a Pokemon of his own. Oh, snap. Here we go. Hala. Welcome to Lola. Young Kukui told me of your coming. I'm glad we got the chance to meet today. Come, my Pokemon, let's have a look at you. Alright. Moment of truth. Who will I pick? Even though I already knew who I've been picking. Grass type Rowlet? Koo. He's so cool. Next is fire type Pokemon Litten. And last is water type Popleo. Bork. He's so close to the Bork. I almost want Borks. Bork seems tempting, but then so does Meme Cat. Huh. Who will it be? Rowlet. Yeah, okay, get it, everyone. Get the get the the oh my god, you got on the hype train out of your system. I want Rowlet. I've wanted Rowlet since the beginning. Rowlet's Bay. He's adorable. And then he got Decidueye. And everyone that said he was going to be Grass Flying type had to eat it because he was a ghost. And he got awesome typing. Only when you have both chosen each other can you truly call each other partners. Here we go. Oh, he's looking at me. Oh, look, look at him. Oh, he's looking at me. Look at that meaningful glance. Oh my god. I really hope he decides to choose me. Oh my god. This is a tense moment. Ah! Please don't judge me. <gasps> no! What? <gasps> oh, okay. Thank god. Oh my god. My heart would have broken. In a million bajillion teensy tiny pieces. Yay! I lifted him gently in my arms. Oh, this is the happiest moment of my Pokemon life. Oh my god, he sounds so cute. Oh, he looks a bit tickled. Am I tickling? Oh my god! He accepted me. Oh. Oh my goodness. It's a, do I want to give him a nickname? Ooh. Ah. Uh. Yes? Hmm. No, let me think. Eh? Let's call him. Lil. Oh shit, I need shift. Because I believe in capitalization. My name is Lil Floof. Actually, let me, uh. Add a little, gotta have proper grammar. Little Floof. That is the proper name. My little Floof is gonna be my best buddy in the whole wide world. Little Floof has been added to my party. And thus began the relationship between me and the cutest starter Pokemon. Sorry everyone else who picked not Rowlet, you're wrong. Wrong. Aw, oh, even Cosmog is really happy for me. When did you get out again? He, you're not good at containing this. He just gets out whenever he wants. You don't really control him. You should stay in the bag and out of sight. It's safer that way. 
think you chose a wonderful Pokemon. Please take very good care of it. Think that's it? You got a Pokemon? You're a Pokemon trainer, yeah! And here's a lovely gift for me to help make it special. Oh, snap, it's a Pokedex. High-tech kind of tool that is possessed by Rotom in this game, I think. Let's see his little Pokedex. Oh, and I got a passport, which is, I guess, your trainer ID, technically speaking, now. I gotta go introduce him to Mom, but I think I'm going to do that in the next episode, if possible. Let me see if I can save. Can I save? Oh, I can. Cool. I will save it here. All right. Thank you guys so much for watching. It's been a fun episode. I'm glad I got my little buddy Rowlet now. He is in my inventory. Where do I see my Pokemon? Here we go. We'll take a good look at him before I end the video. I should hopefully be publishing this this morning, so I hope you guys enjoy when I publish. Sorry again for the quality, but that's the best I can bring up for now. Thank you so much for watching, and as always, make sure to splooge in the comments below.